Hey everyone, it's Matt Sneak. It's one along. Come back to the quick review of the Air Jordan 388. And let's, let's get into the shoe. So I got my shirt on today. I got this at Foot Locker. The reason, got that Nike Air. And I think you all know why. So let's get into the shoe. Let's get into the box. Boom. Got our original uh, Jordan Retro 3 box. Red Jumpman on top. Got this nice black cement around it, so I really like that. Um, getting into the uh, colorway, turn this around. Size 12, Air Jordan 3 Retro 88, $200. Uh, white, fire, red, cement, gray, and black. Let's get a uh, quick shot of that. So the price was a bit high, I want to talk about that real quick. Um, the reason it was high because these are pretty much what the OGs look like. Um, there's one thing on the shoe that does that does not look like the OG. Got right on the inside of the box. One thing I like about right when you open it up, you'll see this black Jordan looking, um, I guess you call it booklet. You uh, open it up. You got all about the shoe. You got about you know the visible air, the like sock liner, the heel sole unit, the four uh, four front. Air sole unit, the foot frame, midsole, the outsole, the upper. You got pretty much a step-by-step -step look at, you know, you know what they're made of, how they're made, you know. You got that right there. It's not what you came to see. You came to see the shoe. Let's get out. Boom, right there. Let's quickly look. You can see, uh, not a lot of people see this, but uh, Nike Air hang tag. Never seen before on a Jordan since they first came out. Don't quote me on that. <laughs> Got this nice little, uh, it's like the outside, you know, um, so I guess a really light cement color paper. I really enjoy that. Let's boom. Let's get it out. Shoe tree. Now, the first thing you're going to notice is that these don't smell like regular um, old shoes. These, those, these, to me at least, they smell like more like factory glue when I mean, they came out of the, you know, factory. Um, and you also notice it's going to quick through 60. You also notice that these are different from previous releases because they are narrower. So I really like that. I don't like my shoes all fat looking. I like my shoes nice and narrow, slick. You know, you got your cocaine white laces, if you'd say. You got your nice, really smooth leather running from the toe box and the upper floor front panels, uh, mid panels actually. And they go up into the shoe pretty much all up. You got some nice stitching around, um, leading up into the uh, the wing of both sides of the shoe. You got these black um, lace lace areas right there. You also got your uh, red, red eyelids, I guess you call them, either eyelids or uh, lace lids, lace lace holes, and. Um, uh, one thing I did notice is that these, um, not sure, um, these are, like, the, um, the breathable areas right here, like, the breathable dots are a lot darker than previous releases, so that's one thing you will notice. They're a lot darker and more looking. You can see them actually better. Um, the breathability holes, like, I, I call them. You also got right there, you see, nice little breathability to keep your back door nice and cool. You got your icing or your cherry on top of the shoe. Red Jumpman. Nice red velvet Jumpman. Really pops when you're wearing red. Velvet inside, if you can see that, it's got Nike Air in black and it's nice velvet. Smooth. I have to say the tongue is the smoothest part. The inside of the tongue, the red velvet right there, feels almost like the first time you had a sock on. You know when you get like a new sock, you put that on, it's exactly the feeling. It just butter smooth, you know, amazing. You have to you have to feel it for yourself. Also, who can forget some uh, elephant print running around the toe box and also in the four four uh, back area as well. Getting into everyone um, wanted to see. Boom, Nike Air. This is um, just incredibly. Uh, this is you know. This is, this is, you know, this is Jordan. This is when Jordan, back when he was just with Nike, uh, before he branched off, 
and you know this is almost pretty much like having an OG shoe and by the way um, the bottoms you get your regular old threes with regular old traction you got your uh, red uh, red Jordan you got your white and your gray as well um, I think Jordan on the bottom is the only thing that separates them from actual OGs and I believe they did that so it wouldn't be a Nike shoe you know because they gotta have Jordan on there because this is Jordan shoe so you got your mid your white mid midsole nice little plastic um, I don't I don't know what the back black part area is I think it's actually part of the midsole just colored to be completely honest and that runs all the way around you see it's got a visible air sole unit on both sides of the shoe and inside of that is gray so really nice shoe I really enjoy this for the price it was kinda steep but you know that's that's what you get when you get practically um, you know a classic Jordan shoe you know it's celebrating 25 years of excellence on the foot on the hardwood and in the air and it's in this original white cement colorway Let's just keep getting a 360 of that uh, I mean, this these launched in February of 1988 when, you know, Michael Jordan took home the slam dunk championship in his own city. He was actually the first basketball player to take home the slam dunk contest in his own city as well. So that was a big moment, you know, especially for Jordan and for the city of Chicago. So, extremely, I really like this. Oh, yeah, I got the uh, tag inside. So, extremely nice shoe. I actually, um, you probably noticed, right when I got these, I had to, uh, I had to, you know, I had to wear them. I had to try them on, I had to get them out there, I had to break them in, I had to de-virginize them, if you'd say. You know, they're just amazing shoes, still smelling so good, so fresh, amazing. If you can cop these for near retail, I say go for it, um, because these are worth having. These are worth having in your collection, um. Definitely, you also get your plastic in the back. Um, I guess you could say heel tab, but yeah, it's however. Um, laces, I extremely like. There was actually some sticky, I'm not sure if it was glue. Uh, I'm not sure if you can see it. There's like some sticky stuff right there. I'm not sure if it was, again, from glue or, you know, maybe something in the factory. Um, I really like the shoe. Um, extremely nice, and there's a little thing um, about them why they released over on the East Coast around 451. I'm not sure if it was different on the West Coast, but in the famous um, picture of when Jordan takes off from the free throw line, makes the uh, slam dunk, I believe that wins him the contest. It was at 351. Um, I think it was p.m. Don't quote me on that. It's probably a.m. And um, sorry, I have my clock off, so I can't really remember. And um, the famous poster in the background you see it says 351 and um, on East Coast time that's 451 so that's why they release at such an odd time and I was able to actually get them I was extremely happy um, you know just all around these things feel so good so comfy um, you know they're, they're just the comfy I think threes are extremely comfy I underestimated the threes I thought fours were better but this shoe just totally blew me away on the thoughts of the fours. I don't own any fours personally. I've worn, I've worn, I've rented, I've done everything with fours, but buy and own them. So, that's pretty much a, uh, that's pretty much how my story goes. So let's get the, uh, let's get the other one. Let's get the, was it the right shoe? Let's get them both side by side. Get them looking, and I will have an on feed of this posted within the next few days so keep an eye out for that sub if you subscribe if you haven't already see more sneakers coming we're gonna get as many as we can galaxy patch release tomorrow hopefully I can get a pair of those if not in my size hopefully I can um you know score them in a smaller size or a bigger size and go ahead and trade them if I have to anyway this has been Matt for Sneak Kids 101 with the uh, Air Jordan 3 88s with the OG colorway, the white cement, and uh, it's been around for Sneak Kids 101. Definitely get the shoe if you can score it um, around uh, retail. 
And uh, it's been my FC Kids 101, and I will see you all later. Bye.